Hello everyone, this is Curtis in the kitchen. That's right, I'm at home in the kitchen and what I'm gonna do tonight is I'm gonna have some uh, some pork chops. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about. These right here, and if I can show them to you. Here we go, right here, yo. These right here, when I'm finna to uh, get some of these pork chops here, and I'm gonna see if I can get, uh, get them all, uh, get them all seasoned up and see if I can just Make them taste good here. What I'm gonna do is try to, uh, let's see, I'm gonna fry them. I'm gonna fry these uh, pork chops here. So I'm gonna uh, get them all seasoned up real good. And we're gonna have some fried pork chops tonight. So give me a minute, let me get all prepared for this and let's see if we can get these pork chops all together. All right, here we go. Stay tuned. Okay guys, as you can see, I got the pork chops out of the package here, and I got them, I got them over here, I'm wrenching them off in some good cold water here, so I just want to get them good and cleaned up, so that um, I can get them prepared, so I can get them all good and seasoned, so you see right here, you just wash them off real good, get them, you want to get them good and washed up, yeah, so just take the unit right here just to get them all washed up and then I'm going to take and put them in a bowl and uh, then we're going to season them up real good here yeah so I always want to take them and get them good good and clean this is where I take them I just wash them off real good with some good cold water okay so give me a minute and I'm going to take and transfer them over to a bowl here. That's right. Okay, then let me let me make preparation so I can get them in a the bowl. Okay, guys. Now what I'm gonna season them up with. Uh, I'm gonna try have some of this uh, Larry. I don't know if you can see it. Focus, focus. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna put some of this Larry season sauce on there. So let me get that in there. I'm gonna take and just take that off and we're gonna sprinkle some of that off in there. Just sprinkle out a little bit of that in there and you know I'm gonna get them good and season up and also while I have that I'm I'm gonna mix it up a little bit I'm also gonna add a little bit of this here uh, season on there too some of this here as you can see snap your mama season on it gonna put that in there so let's uh, sprinkle a little bit of that off of in there so we want to get that in there and you know, while we got that in there we're gonna we're gonna uh, get that off in there real good, so you know we'll move it around, move it around a little bit, so we can get that season off in there, that flavor on both sides of of the pork chop there, so we can get it to taste. We're gonna get that flavor in it. So what I want to do is let that sit a little bit while while I uh, get the oil that I'm gonna use. I'm gonna uh, I'll use some of that. Uh, let's see extra virgin oil to uh, I'm gonna fry these in that so I'm gonna you know, come back let this here sit a little bit and the flavor that season get soaked into the pork chop here and then I'm gonna once that's good and soaked in there then I will take and uh, I'm gonna flour I'm gonna put some flour on there flour them up a little cornstarch and everything I'm gonna have it make it really tasty so uh, that's what I'm do here for this here pork chop so let that sit in for a little while then I'm gonna come back with some flour so that's gonna sit, take a minute all right guys so uh, let me go over here like I have a pan and what, let, let me show you this this pan right here from what I'm gonna be using right here so I'm gonna take and put some of this here this here oil right here in there as you can see the olive oil. I'm gonna pour that in there. I'm gonna let that warm up while the pork chops are over there sitting, and uh, I'm gonna bring them back over here, and we'll we'll get them into this uh, skillet here. All right, stay tuned. Okay, guys, I got uh, the cornstarch here. We're gonna add some cornstarch, and also we're gonna have some of this here, uh, some flour here. So I'm just going to take and uh, pour 
some of that flour off into this bowl right here. Put a little bit of that in there. If I can get it, hold it up good. Yeah, we're gonna, that's gonna be the coating for it. So we are taking and put some flour in there. And uh, then I'll take and uh, add some of this here, uh, this cornstarch. Let me see if I can get the package open right here. And we're gonna add some of this cornstarch so we can coat this real good. Okay, so as you can see, this is right here, this cornstarch. So we're gonna put some of that off in there. That makes it extra crispy. So put that in there. A little of that cornstarch. And then I take and uh, now I'm gonna add some more of this uh, slap your mama season back into that. I wanna coat it, mix that into the flour and the cornstarch for that good coating there. So add a little bit more of that in there. And then also, you know, I was, uh, I had, uh, I had, had some, uh, some of this here, uh, Larry seasoned salt. I'm gonna put some of that off up in there again. Okay. So now once I have all that in there, I'll take and, uh, I want to take and uh, you just take it and kind of shake it, shake it a little bit so it'll blend all in. You want to get it all combined in there. You know, get the flour, the cornstarch, all that shaking up in that flour and all. So when I lay that pork chop off in there, I can get it all good and coated here. You can see right here. So you just shake it a little bit, shake it a little bit there. And, uh, it will uh, be ready. So now I'll take and uh, I'll take and I'll lay one of those pork chops off in there. And you see, we just lay it off in there, just like that. You know, and I'll, I'll take and shake it a little bit, just shake it. So I get it a real good coating, coating on there, as you can see right there. So while I, I'm doing that, I also have the oil extra virgin already uh, warmed up over there so this is this is this is how this pork chop is looking so I want to take and uh, just get it good and coated there on both sides and so we'll take another one and uh, we'll lay it in there so I'll, I'll let that almost sit in there we we'll just shake it a little bit, shake it a little bit, and we'll get that off in there. We want to get it on both sides. So, as you can see, this is the way I do it. And, we get it, you know, it's going to turn out to be a really good seasoned, coated pork chop here. So, got that one in there. So, I'm going to go on and get the other one pork chop. We're going to put it in there. And uh, get it all seasoned up. You can add a little bit of this little pinch of it right here. Put a little bit there. And we'll just take and shake it. Just you know, shake it till you get it all coated on there real good. I'm at, let me lay that over there a little bit. I like to lay them in there and just shake it around. So make sure that I get it coated on both sides real good. So, we'll get it all floured up real good here with the cornstarch and all the season on it again. So, this is it guys. This is, this is the way I fix my pork chops. So, I'm gonna fry it. Let me just shake it a little bit more. All right. There we go. So once I, you know, have it like that, now it's good and ready to take. And uh, we'll take it and uh, we'll bring it over here. 
and what I'll do is uh, I'll take and uh, I'll just get one of them out right here and we'll just take and lay right in there like that there right there and let it sizzle you see right there I'm going to take another one get another one out of here I'm going to take it and bring it over and just lay it right in there just like that right there and then I'll turn it over and we'll get it good and crispy so I'll let that lay there for a few minutes and it'll brown on that side there and we'll have a good crispy pork chop here okay guys yeah, so that's the way I'm doing it and you know as, as just lay there then I'll grab these right here you know we'll take them and just turn it over see like that like that take and turn that one over there we go so you see that's it hmm so it, it you know it's it's gonna sit right there and fry I'm gonna fry it on a, a low heat right here on a medium you just let it cook all the way through real slow and it'll make it good and tender and all all right guys so I'm just sharing this little help portion here so I'll come back and I'll show you the rest of it when I get it all finished up all right stay tuned all right guys the moment that we've been waiting for was those pork chops I got them all fried up and all so I want to give y'all a view of the way they turn out and all and I have uh, took the liberty already get them all get one on a plate with some beans and macaroni so uh, let's take a look at what I'm talking about here here we go here we go okay as you can see this is what I'm talking about I fixed me a plate already right there where I have them the macaroni and cheese and the beans and the pork chops and I got two more of them left over here so now you know what time it is it's time for me to sample some of this here you know what I'm gonna be sampling I'm gonna sample some of that pork chop but I'm just gonna go ahead and grab it and give y'all a little sample of it let's see here y'all know oh boy here we go That's tender and good. Mmm. Mm -hmm. See that? See that? See how it looks? Cooked all the way through. Mmm. That's tasty too. All the seasoning in it. Mmm. Which I slow cooked it. No rush. Just took my time and cooked it. Mmm. That's good, guys. Now, hey. I just wanted to share this with y'all. But now, I, I showed you all the steps that you need to do you some of these nice pork chops here so uh hey don't be shy from the kitchen just get in there and do what you got to do get you some pork chops season them up flour and some cornstarch and uh, put some of your seasons on there and you have a delicious pork chop i tell you hey i got this is smelling good guys i can't waste no more time i got to go on and finish this pork chop up it's standing here and it's calling my name and I gotta get into this. I gotta go and eat this macaroni and cheese and beans. All right, guys, stay tuned. I got some more to come, but I'm finna go on and get in my meal now. Y'all take care. Bye.